Okay, so the next step in my view, in a very practical way, to counter this notion that my religion doesn't enable me to be a donor is to say in the media, but there's no religion that stops you from being a recipient. It's the only way to counter it. Uh, and uh, the other thing I would say is this. We are a common humanity. And when you say that, you can take an Israeli kidney and it will work absolutely well in a Palestinian. And vice versa. You can take a Palestinian heart and it will work absolutely fine in an Israeli. That's one. You can take a Muslim liver and it will work perfectly fine in a Christian. You can take a Christian kidney and it will work well in a Buddhist. We are a common humanity. The organ that's donated, it knows no gender. The organ donated knows no gender. It knows no ethnicity. It knows no culture. So, ethnicity, the African-American kidney works very well. One of you. You say those things yes. and people understand, right? All of these um, overlays of culture and ethnicity and bias, they get all swept away in the fundamental we are a common humanity. The strength is that we are now explaining that this is a program for all of the people. That's the strength. Once the people understand that this is for all of the people, not just for the rich. And Jinnai, with its ability to care for all of the people, this is a strength of, this is a strength of this community.